Hello, hello, Taurus, and welcome into Speak Life. My name is Mia. Today is June 16th. We're going to do the dark side today. Only because I couldn't do it yesterday. <laughs> Listen, I also want to let you know that June mid-readings are posted. So, oh, fuck. Taurus, why do you start off the reading with the two saddest cards in the entire deck? Please subscribe to the channel if you haven't done so. I bring you messages every day simply because everybody is not going to resonate with the stories, with every single story. Oh, God. You got four cards here, and I'm going to let you know all four are not good. Well, we got the Empress. Building something brand new, wanting to bring... You want to walk away from something. Something's got you stuck. Something's got you in a really bad burden situation. This is the devil energy. Listen, Torres, some of you, you're be your life is being run by the devil. I can't even say that enough. This has you, whatever has happened has you a little heartbroken, you know? It's got you a little heartbroken. However, you are wishing that you can actually get out of this. You just don't know how to get out. But you know what? Something is coming in to change your destiny. Something is coming. Okay, so you, I took that because I just felt that I should. Okay, let's see what the bottom of the energy is. I'll take that too. Let's see what we have here. All right, um, Taurus, five of cups. You're fighting with someone. Someone is fighting with you. This is a fighting situation. This is arguing. This is feeling loss, disappointment, and everything else. This is you investing a lot and just hearing something constantly from someone. You feel that you've invested so much into this that maybe you just are nervous about walking away. You also have here the page of pentacles. It looks like you're waiting for some good news to come in for you. It could be a message. It could be, you know, it could be a new a new job this could also you know it's it's good news it's you waiting on good news it has to do with with money but listen you're going through this for me is a karmic relationship i'm just gonna let you know what i feel as of right now i haven't even done the rest of the cards however i feel that this is a karmic relationship this is something that you have to learn this is toxicity this is somebody toxic in your life this person causes you a lot of heartbreak you know this person may not be all they're cracked up to be maybe this is you keep in mind the energies can be reversed this is a heartbreak. This is the empress. The empress is someone who plans something brand spanking new. For those of you who don't want to have a child, be careful at this time. Although there may be a lot of you that are, you know, secretly planning on having a baby. Not sharing it with anyone. Five of Pentacles. Okay, so listen, you did get the two status cards in the deck. These are it. This is you feeling out in the cold. This is you probably leaving out somebody out in the cold. This could be you sneaking away from this person, leaving them, you know? This, could, this is you having money struggles. You're having money struggles and it looks like somebody is going to leave you out in the path. In, in the, or this, like I said, this could be you leaving somebody out in the cold. And listen, this decision has been haunting you forever. It is a decision that goes back and forth, back and forth. What do I do? What do I do? What do you know? What do I do with this situation? And you're, this situation is heavy. 
it's heavy, it's frustrating, it's you overextending your kindness and somebody simply making it worse for you. Taking advantage, sitting on your fucking back. <sighs> Something's coming in to change this. For those of you that are refusing to change, change is coming in. It'll knock your socks off when it does. And listen, you can do all the hoping that you want, all the wishings upon the stars. However, if you don't remove yourself from this overextension that you're giving to this person, to this devil energy who's causing you nothing but problems and chaos, your wishes can't come true when you're in this situation. You're confused. Listen, this is the last card that you get. You're confused and you don't know what to do. Why is the five of cups here for Taurus? Please, universal energy, spirit, guides, and ancestors. Why is the five of cups here? You want a passionate new beginning with someone. You know, if you, for some of you, this could be that this somebody else discovered that you were investing in something else. Because you really want to find love in your life. However, you're stuck with this devil energy. Why is the devil here? Why is the devil here? Queen of Pentacles. Listen, this woman could be a woman who is independent. She could be a woman that helps you out financially. This could also be you. However, your life is being run by the demon right now. Listen, when we get stuck with unhealthy people, things really don't turn out on our favor. This is you maybe trying to get away from this devil energy by independizing yourself so you don't have to count on this queen anymore. Listen, whatever this situation is, it's come to an end. This heartbreak something has come to an end for some of you this could have been even though i don't see it here yet this could be a three-party situation it if it's not this if it is not and you don't know please don't go making things up if it is not a three-party situation it means that you are heartbroken that this situation you know will eventually come to an end Empress, Empress. All right, we got three. I'll take them. Again, you got you got the seven of cups. You have a lot of options in your life. You know, you have a lot of opportunity. But you're confused. Princess of Wands. This is good news coming in for you. You know, this is... This is somebody wanting to give you a message. However, some, you wanting to give a message to someone. Ten of Cups. Some of you are looking for this Ten of Cups. You're wishing for this Ten of Cups. It's in your desires. It is something that you wish for. It is hidden inside your soul. You may also be starting out a, a new... A new beginning. It's kind of what I pick up. Why is the Five of Pentacles here? Five of Pentacles. I don't know if you left somebody out in the cold or somebody is leaving you out in the cold. However, if you are going through money struggles, you're currently holding on to your money because you believe that that's going to give you some kind of stability. Why is the Two of Swords here? Why is the Two of Swords here? Please, Universal Energy, Spirit, Guides, and Ancestors. Why is the Two of Swords here? Ooh. Oh, shoot. Okay. Let me go get those. Um, slowest night in the deck. This decision is taking you forever to make. These are the two that fell on the floor. 
right. This is the Knight of Wands. Listen, somebody's going to come in all crazy and fired up. They're not going to want you to go. But you know what? It's got to be let go. The world is here. The universe is giving you, Taurus, listen up. The universe is giving you an opportunity to clean this slate up. If not, you will miss this opportunity of the world coming in for you. That's only what I'm picking up. For some of you that have done the work. Okay, where are my deck? Oh, God. For some of you that have done the work, the universe has come in. And it's taking you away from this and it's giving you a brand new opportunity. You've already gone around the world and you have learned your lesson. Do not repeat the same thing. If not, guess what? It's going to take you a long fucking time to go around the world again to come back. You don't want to repeat this twice. This has been, this relationship has been filled with heartbreak. It's been filled with arguing and fighting and being left out in the cold. This is demonic energy. It is the energy, you know, the devil will run it for you if you let it. This could also be your inner demon. And this person is clearly helping you out financially. And this is why some of you stay. The problem is that if you keep repeating the cycle, you are just never gonna finish. You just keep going around and around and around. And, you, and this basically, this situation, I'm going to be honest, this situation really has no growth. Ten of Wands. This is another ending. This is you putting your burdens down. You got the Ten of Wands and the Ten of Swords. We have two cards on the floor. <clears throat> Queen of Cups. If you're looking for the Queen of Cups, you're looking for somebody who is who is a little bit more mature. You're looking for somebody who is you're looking for somebody who's classy. Look at this mermaid, the way she's just sitting up there with her cup. This is a queen. She is loving, she is caring. She's a very intuitive woman. She's a good woman. She's a good wife. She's a good mother. And wishes can only be granted to you with the world card once you let the devil stop running your life you need to let this go if you don't let this go listen you, we can't wrap things up and what happens is you start the cycle over do you really want to do this over taurus don't repeat the same lesson You've already finished. You've already successfully completed a chapter. For those of you who are ready to grow and ready to leave this behind, good things are here. Okay? And if not, listen, the universe will take the world back and, you, and it's going to let you repeat the cycle one more time. Thank you so much for being here, part of my Sacred Space Speak Live. I will see you back here tomorrow. Take care.